we're going to be cleaning up the fresh water tank. So I'm gonna, the fresh water tank's under here, it's a thousand litres. I'm gonna hoover around first so no bits of uh, dust and crap go in the bottom. Yeah, we're gonna clean up the uh, tank because it's, um, we've had the boat three years and it hasn't been done. And I've noticed that um, the water even coming through has got, just got a slight film on. So I'm gonna uh, open up the tank and give it a good squirt. Before we take any floorboards up, Simon and I have made it a practice to vacuum first. And then once we do pull up the floorboards, we also have a quick vacuum around the bilge area. This just helps keep the boat nice and tidy. Oh man, why is it always, it's always difficult on a boat. I can't believe it. There's a bar going across where the, uh, the lid comes off. So that's gonna make it interesting. Is it time to maybe call somebody and ask them? Why yeah. don't you call it Oyster? They're still they're still around. Yeah. Hey, it's Simon of Britkin. Um, I just have to some information. What I want to do is uh, clean out my water tank, and I'm just wondering what the best way of doing it is. Please, just getting sort of like a film on it. And what I want to do is clean out the um, the tank. So I'm just, it's sealed. What's the best way to unseal it and the best way to clean it? Okay, so I've just found Oyster and uh, they've explained that there was two of these um, glass bits and I, I didn't know, so I've just found the other one um, because it's got a baffle in the middle of it and it stops the water all sloshing about, especially when we get to um, halfway and down the tank. And he's explained how to take them off it's really quite a bit of a pain and quite difficult and getting them back on is even worse so uh, wish me luck so you just have to take off both those plastic c caps right? yeah and then All clean right. it because it's going to have um, gunk and grime on it so I've got to clean all that up and make sure it all goes back nicely. Okay, and so you're going to clean up the plastic bit? Is that what you're talking plastic about? Plastic bit, and then there's an o there's a there's a rubber O-ring underneath. And do we need a replacement O-ring? No, it shouldn't do. He says. Okay, and so how how are you going to clean in there with a hose or with a scrub brush? Um, I'll let you know once I get the top off. <laughs> are you okay back there? Yeah. What's wrong? Something just fell on my finger. Are you okay? Mm, no, not really. Found what? it! Where are you? I'm here. Where was it? Under Sienna's bank. Bunk. Okay, well that's good. So this should help you to open it, Hopefully, yeah? Hopefully, yeah. I wondered what that was for. Yeah, now we know. Yeah. <laughs> it's a ten minute job on a boat takes two hours. I've got a bar over this one. Yeah. And here I've got a big speaker system with a block of wood that's stopping me get to it. So you have to remove that wood. I don't know yet. <sighs> See me in five. Okay. Hopefully you'll still be laughing. I'm always laughing. Okay. Well, I would suggest doing this one first because it's easier to get to. And the other one, you're going to have to take off that big speaker. Like I said, it's never easy on a boat. So what's up? Well, I was hoping this was going to be able to come up. It doesn't look like it's moving. There's two screws in there. And two screws in there. And I'm just... I don't know if they've done like a tongue and groove. Hi Kate, it's Simon again. Can you put me through to Eddie please if he's, if he's available? Okay, so I've got the big key on it and uh, I'm going to use the friendly persuader. That's it, start to move. Okay. interesting to see what's in there. Yeah. It's just water. Mm. Does it look gross? How's it looking there? Looking a bit icky. Does it look icky? Yeah. And this is our drinking water. Yep. Which we haven't been drinking. No. 
but which we would like to drink, especially yeah. if we would go to the Pacific. We need drinking water. Okay, clean. I'm just going to see how dirty it is. And there you go. Yuck. What do you think that is? It's just mold, bit of mold. Mold maybe yeah. or something? So all those little brown spots you see there, that's dirt or grime or something. So because we don't have a record of the previous boat owner, we don't know if this was ever clean. Well, hey, look, you can see a bit of white there. Yeah. Wow, look at the difference. Uh, it's going to be cleaned. Yeah. Maybe we'll be able to drink our water again. Mm. Right, okay. Okay, that's great. All right then, I'll just take my time with it. Th thanks, Eddie. So is it coming up at our time? <laughs> just a little bit? Yeah. Slowly, slowly, yeah? Stuff what? <laughs> Stuff growing on the side of that. On the side of the baffles. What? Oh, in there? Mm. Ugh. Oh, the smell. I don't know. It smells. I See all those black dots in there? That is all mold. That is just disgusting. Pewly. Okay, well, uh, we're just in the process of cleaning it bit by bit and slowly doing it. It's going to take a couple of hours, but. It's going to look great afterwards. Okay, so we started at 10. It is now 4 o'clock. I'm now refilling the tank, but after I've scrubbed it and I've now put um, a flushing agent through it, a water tank flushing agent, and I've got that about half full, and then I've opened out all the taps so it flushes all through all the pipes and everything. I've closed them off. I'm now filling it up to the top. I'm going to leave it for 30 minutes and then I'm going to drain the tank again, spray it all down, get all rid of all the agent and then top it up with um, some fresh water and then we'll have a taste test and see how it goes. You look tired. I am. I'm pumping out the um, cleaning solution, see all the um, bubbles in there, so we're just going to empty it all out and uh, Flush it through and then put fresh water in. <laughs> oh, no. What happened, Sam? I don't know. I'm borrowing something and it's just messed up. <laughs> what happened? I think it might be full. So Simon's sucking the water out of the tank and it just sprayed out the back hole and got everything down the hallway soaked. No, don't you not get any on video? She's not getting any on video telling you that. What? Getting what? Well, it's spraying out the back. <laughs> <laughs> You're not going to make that mistake twice? Well, hopefully not. What time is it, Sam? Late, late o'clock. <laughs> it is now 20 to 7. And you're still going? Yeah, nearly <laughs> finished. You won't need a checklist telling you that you need to clean out your water tank. A bad taste or smell will let you know that the job needs to be done. There are, however, other sailboat maintenance items that need to be done routinely. 
If you're a new boat owner and haven't purchased my guide titled Checklist for Sailors, Passage Planning, Sailboat Maintenance, Cleaning, Medical and More, you might want to take a look at it. When Simon and I started out, we didn't know how to do much of anything. Over the past three years, we've learned loads, and whatever we do learn, we're working hard to pass it on to you. Click the link above or visit the description area of this video on YouTube to learn more. And lastly, if you like our videos, please hit subscribe below. We aim to publish a new video every week so long as we're on land.